If you're looking for a reason to smile on this Friday, we got you covered. July is Disabilities Pride Month. It's a chance to promote civil rights protection for people with disabilities and assure that all Americans benefit from their talents. This morning, Tiffany Lee introduces us to one young woman in Arkansas with cerebral palsy. She is impacting hundreds of people with her talents. I was out of school for two weeks or, or more because a lot of people had COVID in school, and so I'm like, well, I'm going to make a difference in this world by writing a bunch of letters to people. It was that random thought a little over a year ago that started Allison Bond's mission, kindness through letters. Well, I started, like, you know, writing prisoners and writing soldiers. It didn't take long to realize she was making a difference. It was awesome seeing my, you know, the first letter that they wrote. I have one frame from a soldier. He had all his battle buddies sign it, so I framed it so I could put it up. And she's kept every letter back since, which is quite a few, because in just 14 months, she's written over a thousand. I'm just trying to, like, make people's day a little bit brighter. It's the encouragement Allison's grandma gave to her before passing away. She told me to keep doing something good. Allison's mom, Kathy, says growing up, she hated writing, but now it's become a passion. It's a way to connect with others. I, I enjoy making people happy, spreading God's love to them who otherwise wouldn't feel it. Touching not only strangers, but those closest to her as well. It makes her really happy, and it makes me happy, too, to see her happy. <laughs> You can tell Aww. her mom is so proud. I know. Allison has written more than a thousand letters, as she said, but she also has 600 more she's about oh, to wow. send off. And she says her goal is to eventually make Kindness Through Letters an official nonprofit to help reach more people across the globe. Oh, incredible. That's a lot of writing. It's nice to receive, you know, handwritten letters. Yes. It's, it's more kind of heartfelt, and it's especially nice for those serving overseas who oh. might not have contact with anybody in general, so it's you always bet. nice to receive that. And a young mm. woman doing this, yeah. just because she had some extra time and look what it's turned into. Yeah, yeah. she seems super kind.